just wanted to show you a little more of the area. Um, this is not where the plot of land is. Um, like I said, this is close to my hometown. Too much traffic for a Sunday morning. This is Saint Nepomuk, who is the saint of bridges or something like that. And this used to be a little, uh, I guess you could call it a mansion. Um, now it's a hotel and a restaurant. The usual change. see if uh, the church is open, the chapel is open on the way out. I love the gate. I wonder how expensive the upkeep is. You know what? That doesn't look like a restaurant or a hotel. I guess it's really just the front part. I don't know if you noticed the benches, but there's some benches there. And I wanted to go to the where. This is a look back. And here we are. God, what a huge building. Have to make sure that I don't lose the camera. Eee, that would be horrible. This is for electricity. So it's not just to stop flooding. They're producing electricity here. Not bad. I mean, if you can do it, why not? On my house, I want to have... Um, oh, I don't know how to say it in English, it's not just solar panels, it's uh, the type of solar panels that produce electricity. Not sure what they're called in English, sorry. I just want to see what's behind the curve here. To be honest, I've never taken a walk here. I've driven past so many times. But as usual, you drive past, but you never stop. 
shame really, isn't it? This is lovely back here. I know it's more of a jungle, but hey, it's pretty. So this is the, the view from around the curve, and I have a suspicion that this used to be a railway line because the gravel you see here is what's used on railway lines and it kind of has the shape of it except for the curve but you know railway lines have curves but it's on a dam it's as straight as they can make it. It's a long curve. Yeah, might be. I don't know if you can see the deer, but we scared it because there's a car coming. Well, that shouldn't. Can you see the deer? <laughs> Poor thing. Didn't mean to scare it. All right, there's not much more to see. This is the way back. This, I'm sure, is flooded um, every time the snow melts or when there's a lot of rain. I don't know if you can see between the pylons, there's a steeple on the horizon. I can't zoom in any further, but there's like a dip in the forest, in the trees, in the distance. And then you see a steeple. That's already the beginning of my hometown. So, didn't walk far, but it was a nice little walk. On a cool summer's day, starting to feel like August almost. But it's lovely. Uh, August. <gasps> Autumn. <laughs> yes, it does feel like August because this is August. It's actually too cold for August. Hazelnuts. Some hazelnut bushes. Uh, I don't know if the camera can pick this up, but in the very distance, let me see. You may see some cars whizzing past. That's an Autobahn. So, uh, I may have to take it back to this dam here that I'm walking on that I thought it might be a railroad track, an old railroad track. It might just be a dam to hold back the water, the flood waters, because this part gets flooded then. This is towards the river. So the farmers cannot really use it when it's flooded. And I don't know what the quality of the grass is like and so forth and so forth. It's prob probably wet all the time, meaning they can't really drive on here very well with their tractors because those tractors are heavy. This, on the other hand, is a little drier. It's still wet. You can see the willow trees. Um, you can see um, the reed. But it'll be kept a little drier. 
and I hear a bird of prey. I'm not quite sure if the camera can pick it up though. So, I'm going back to the car now. Laters!